grows straight and tall in the San Joaquin Valley. It feeds the cows on dairy farms that are the backbone of the economy around tiny Hillmar, California. You can't get too far away from cows here. A lot of their milk turns into Hillmar cheese. This factory is the largest local employer. Before work, the place to go for a cup of coffee and the latest news is Rita's Country Cafe. Talk this morning is about the Hillmar High football team's winning streak. They haven't lost a game in four years. Well, I, I think there's pressure on the kids, sure. And that, but uh, it takes that pressure, too, to uh, something to fight for. Nobody wants to be the loser, so they go out to win. Outside Rita's is the only traffic light in Hillmark, but 43 straight wins coming into this season has made this small town big news. I think we get a lot of respect from different schools and even bigger schools. They know how hard our coaches work us and how much our coaches put their work into. We have to depend on each other a lot. We have to work together as a team being real small. This year too, we have to really work hard and no bickering or anything to each other. It has to be a big team effort. For many, growing up in this quiet agricultural area would seem like something out of the movies. But come Friday night, Hillmar's Field of Dreams is McSweeney Field, where the Yellow Jackets haven't lost a home game since 1981. <laughs> With nothing but wins for four years, Hillmar's coach dreams of perfection. I think, I think in terms of how it could be, and, and I mean, I do that with our practice, with our team. I think in terms of how good I think they can be, how much I think they can do, and, and how much I think I can do. Hillmar plays smash face football on the ground, grind it out. Their success comes from preparation and conditioning. We talk about breaking concrete with a sledgehammer. Uh, you know, you can hit it 15 or 20 times before it cracks, but once it cracks, it goes in a hurry. And we take that same philosophy into the game, every game, that, that we're going to hammer away at the opponent, and, and it may be close at halftime. We might be behind, but sooner or later, if, we, if we're persistent, they will crack. The California record of 47 straight wins is within reach this season, but what happens if they lose? We will accept that when it does come, but we're just going to have to bounce back and play the next game even tougher. It's the only reason you really go to practice. You don't practice to lose. You practice to win all the time. This year's season opener pushed the Hillmar streak to 44. Their victories may look easy, but the green and gold know their dreams of setting a new record won't come true on this field without a lot of hard work. Nothing comes easy, and you have to work hard if you're going to get something worthwhile. You have to work hard. If you're going to do it, do it right. Boy, there's nothing like a win streak to build the old excitement, get the adrenaline running. It's the same kind of excitement that we have here each and every week when we bring you a brand new Scholastic Sports America honor roll.